The rowing team took the water today in pairs. Head coach Lisa Glenn says rowing in twos is a good teaching tool. We're rowing in the pairs right now to just increase their boat intellect, um, their sensitivity to the positives that they do, the positive impact they can have on the boat is very evident to them. They can feel it. Um, obviously, the resulting boat speed is evident when they do something good. When they do something that negatively impacts the speed of the boat, they feel that right away. So it's almost like having a silent coach in the boat with you and getting instantaneous feedback when you're out there. Senior Liz Dixon is ready to step up in a leadership role. It's my last year and it's a big year. We have two senior rowers and one senior coxswain and we have a pretty small group this year but we have a good intense group so they don't need a lot of firing up but keeping everyone motivated, keeping everyone on track, being that enforcement to practice is a big thing. The group has already made big improvements from week one to week two and Coach Glenn is very excited about their progress. We're in 15 minutes earlier than we were last Tuesday for the same distance. So I was just talking to one of the rowers about how, you know, we need to be seeing that because we're not just going to be doing the same thing every week. We want to increase our volume and increase the distance that we row and clearly they're ready to do that. So that's one thing. The other is just better sensitivity to the boat with the pair partners and they're, they're working better together. They're taking more risks out there on the water, doing things that aren't as comfortable, but because they trust each other more and that's good to see. The team will continue to work on their finesse and technique on the water, and the veterans will help the newcomers along in any way that they can. For UTSports.com, I'm Danny Kleppinger.